guys, welcome back. Today we're doing another Yummy Nummies Mini Kitchen Magic. I'm so excited. This is the Cookie Creations Maker. I love cookies, so I mean, I'm gonna love this. This makes 10 mini cookies. If you don't know what Yummy Nummies are, they're like these little packets of powder and you add water and then you microwave them or sometimes refrigerate them for a short amount of time and they, they make these cute little foods that a lot of the time taste really good. So these are vegetarian, they are not vegan. And it's just, these are really fun to make whether you want to eat them or not. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to get this open and then we will get started. So let's see what we have in here. Okay, we of course have the tray. I'm going to set that over here. We have this little pamphlet that shows you all the different yummy nummy kits that are available. And we have the instructions. And we have all of our mixes. See what we have. We have the candy chocolate chip, the white chocolate chips, and the cookie dough. This is so exciting. And then we have this with a little bag, which I assume you put your cookies in, with a scoop and a spoon and a piping bag. This is cool. Okay. We probably won't need the bag for a while, so I'll set that way over there. Also, with the uh, tray, we're going to need to cut it here. Tray, the mixing tray and the microwaving tray. And then we'll set the microwaving tray over there. Ignore this big giant stain that's from all the other yummy nummies kits that we've done. So let's see what we have to do first with the instructions. Okay, it says open the cookie dough packet and mix eight round scoops of cookie dough with water. But I have to get the water in a minute. Oops. Okay, we have our cookie dough and we have our little scooper. So we do eight round scoops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one more, eight. And then, what's our water? We have to put in four square scoops of water. So, one, two, three, and four. And we get our spoon and then we mix it all together. Mix, mix, mix. A little bit chunky, but that's fine. Smells good like cookies. I like baked goods in general. All right, so let's see what we do next. Okay, so the directions give us two options. I'll show you guys. Okay, you can make cookies with just candy coated chips or make cookies with white chocolate chips. So, I'm not sure. I think I want to do a little bit of both. So I might do the plain ones because the white chocolate chips, you melt them and then you make like a frosting. And then that's what it looks like anyway. And then the candy coated, you just add them to the uh, cookies. So let's bring back our tray. We have four cookies to make and let's go ahead and fill them up like so. Try to get them all evenly distribu just distributed this time. They kind of smell like chocolate cookies. <laughs> I think I did that pretty evenly this time. Let's try to actually spread them out a bit. <laughs> And then like now's the time to add the candy chocolate chips, which where did I put them right here? So we'll do half and half. Look at how pretty the candy chocolate. Oh, <laughs> it's remind me of those, of those things on those brownies, those cosmic brownies. I 
I think that's a lot of chips. Try to get my spoon back and then like maybe mix it around like that. Ooh, and then they'd be like actual chocolate chip cookies. Cause I think it just says to pour them on the top. Like that. And then for these two, we're just gonna bake them regularly and then we'll melt the chips for later. So we're gonna go ahead and microwave this for 15 to 20 seconds. All right, so this is what the cookies look like. They look so yummy. Look at those. Oh, so yummy. So we have to set these aside while we melt our white chocolate chips. Oops, there goes the candy coated cookie chips. Um, so we open the bag of white chocolate chips. Look at them, they look so cute. And then we get our piping bag. And we fill it up with these white chocolate chips. Like that. Get those away in there, like that. And then we fill a bowl with warm water and dip the chips into the water. And they should melt. So, I got the bowl of warm water. And we're just gonna dip it in here and we'll see. Do not, make sure you don't get any uh, water inside the bag. I feel like microwaving these would have been faster. And they're melting a little bit. All right, I think this is pretty much melted. I'm not, not, it's, we gotta work fast though. So let's get the cookies out of here. I'm gonna work on the little paper towel because I didn't get a plate for anything. So we pop the cookies out, one cookie. That's one of the plain ones. So I'm gonna leave the chocolate chip ones. Oh no, I broke this one. <laughs> Oops. Oh well, it's fine. Um, I'm gonna leave the chocolate chip ones in there until we decorate these. So you have to cut the bag and then you just decorate them. Let's see, let's do a heart. Oh no, that's not gonna work. I feel like, oops, I feel like this needs melted way more. But look how cute of a piping bag this is. I'm gonna do a smiley face. Maybe not. See, it's just hardening. It needs to be kept warm. Eep. And this, let's just get rid of that. And then, let's try it again. This isn't gonna <laughs> work. So I'm just gonna, just gonna squirt it all out. There's not gonna be any pattern. We're blocked, it's blocked. Maybe there's just some solid chips in here. Definitely a tip, make sure this is much warmer. So let's just, well, there we go. It's abstract, it's art. <laughs> um, let's get the chocolate chip cookies, which kind of broke. Maybe these needed to go in longer. And voila, where's our bag? Here's our bag it up with our cookies. Like that. But I'm gonna eat these too, so. Let's try this one first. It was really, really, really good. Let's try this one and compare them. I definitely like the um, chocolate chip one better. It's just, I don't know, the white chocolate overpowered the cookie a little bit. But I really, really like the chocolate chip ones. These are good too. They have the same base, they taste really good, just depends on whether you want the white chocolate on it or not. White chocolate or milk chocolate, basically. I love the milk chocolate one, but these are both so yummy. Give this video a thumbs up if you guys want to see more yummy, nummy, mini kitchen magic things. It's just so much fun to do these. Also, let me know in the comment section down below which 
which kit you would like to see me do next. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. Hey guys, we're back again with another blind box bag box. I really need to think of a title for this box. <laughs> so we are going to pick another five random blind bags slash boxes to open today.